This is such a mistake. My mother wanted me to be a farmer. But Guns is what we dead, need, boss. Syndicate always have more than us. Way more. We can't win a war without enough weapons. Syndicate get regular supplies from the gentry factories. I know of a depot they run in a warehouse by West India Quay. I say we break in there and clean it out. You must be joking. Security will be tighter than a rat's arse there. I'd have to send a whole team in to get more than a handful of guns. It's too dicey by half. I know a gal that might be able to help us. An old, uh, associate. She could find a way past the systems there. At least long enough to shift some crates out. We just need someone to break in and open the loading bay from the inside. No, this is just stupid. Get your fucking brain in gear. I want to hurt the dogs, not do some petty theft. Anything we nick, they just replace in a week. We'd be better off burning the place down. Destroy whatever's there. Fancy security and all, and fuck up their supply operations for months. Wouldn't even take much explosives to fry a weapons dump. You're cool, boss. But there's bound to be some lovely gear in there. Would be a crying shame to see it all go to waste. If we're burning a place down, then there's no harm in nabbing some guns while we're at it, is there? Okay, sure. But that's just some frosting. The real aim here is to fuck over the Syndicate. You've been paying attention, Wayfarer. Good. Take these charges. Find a way into this warehouse and set them somewhere that'll cook extra crisp. And take this old card of mine and go see Frosty Valentina. She runs a bakery these days near Millwall High Street. She should recognize the card from our old days. I'd go see her myself, but the Syndicate sniffers would kill me on sight. Tell her what you're about, and she can sort you with something to bypass the security systems. Waste of time. We don't need this Millwall bint. Hey, no need to talk about Valentina like that. Fine. I just want the fucking job done. No distractions. A new face. Hello, sugar. Can I interest you in some lovely ass buns? Or maybe you prefer a frosted finger? But I don't know anyone called. Oh, it's Tony. Tony the tall man. Bless my Gideon, I've not heard from him in donkeys. Oh, we've had some history, I'll tell you that. What does that old devil want all of a sudden? Those days are far behind me, dearie. But if Tony sent you, I guess I can help. I don't have the right components just lying around, mind. Let's see. I need you to fetch me some copper, a set of circuitry, and a bit of plastic. Then I'll see what I can cobble together. Ever so compliant, aren't you? Well, run along then, pup. Back so soon? How's the search? Oh, lovely. Come down my back passage, love, and I'll see how I can fix you up. Step right up. Take a look. Farewell. If you're buying, I'm selling. Farewell. Right, now show us your bits. I used to work a lot with Tony on quacking syndicate systems, so I know how to get my fingers cleanly up a dog's back doors, as they say. 
but I don't have all the crafts I used to, so this will have to do for you. This card will get you through the electronic lock on the outside of the building and should put the security system into maintenance mode for a few minutes. It won't open any internal locks though, and if you trip any other alarms, then the security will reset. So watch where you put your bum about. Good luck with this, sugar. And if you see Tony, do tell him to come visit sometime. I wouldn't mind having my hands on his tools again, if you know what I mean. Nah, someone's having a bubble here. for that, you prick. Oof! Funny bugger, is it? I thought I could hear... Ugh, must have been a rat. You're gonna wind up on one of those meat hooks, you slag. Oh, God. You... Careful where you tread, or you'll give me a reason to have fun. 
Look where you're going. Hey. Touch me again and there'll be consequences. Didn't your mum well, well, teach you the better? Hero returns. The boys came back a while ago, told me you did a fine job, and they nabbed a good haul too. The old gang's gonna be better equipped now. I owe you a pint for this, mate. Enough of that. I want a proper debrief. Tell it from the start. Oh, how's she holding up? Oh, she is a cheeky one. Well, well, if things settle down a bit, it would be nice to pay her a visit. This is making me fucking sick. And you can forget about things settling down. That's the opposite of what's going to happen. But never mind that. You got into the warehouse then. Very nice. You've done well. These supplies are going to make a big difference, believe me. I'm well chuffed. Listen to you two mugs. Clapping yourselves on the back over nothing. The Syndicate still stands. A couple of crates of guns won't bother them. We've risked a lot for pittance here. Pathetic. What, two groups of enforcers on top of you and you just waltz back in all alone to blow things up? Gordon fucking Bennett. That's some moxie you got there, mate. I'll say. Bloody amazing. Well, I'm glad you're on our side. I wouldn't want to go up against someone as fucking mad as that. Something like this deserves a special reward. Here, have this, pal. It's that laser rifle I showed you earlier. I've been tinkering away at it, and she's a right daisy now. I hope it serves you well. Right. Well, that's a happy ending and a half. Now, what's next? Let's take a breather, lads. Look Wait where you're going. I'll come back in a few days. I need some time to think. If you hang round, wouldn't hurt none. We need the numbers.